Um, okay. Well, hey, now that the weather's fun. warming up, we're thinking about summer. And you need to get all the things you need now to get that great summer makeup look. So what do you need to have in your makeup bag just to stay on trend? What do I need to have in my makeup bag? Well, Jen? let's go to Southampton Bucks County. Well, yes, we are with Ani White from Ani White Cosmetics. Good morning, gorgeous. Good morning. Okay, so we wanted to look at the editorial trends. Correct. And you say they're not super great for everyone, but we can use one or two of them. Correct. Okay, mm -hmm. talk to me about these eyes. Okay. So the eyes this year, the, the summer that they're showing, they're showing very vibrant, green, bold, and bold lips, which okay. we'll talk about in a minute. But they're also showing this rosy blush look. Okay. I love the look, not necessarily all together maybe. Um, a little bit more minimalist when you do the blush, that would be give you just enough pop and a glossy lip would be nice. The eyes are great, they're bold, but I would personally to make it a little bit more realistic. Okay. I would almost blend in something a little bit. Show more us neutral. a little bit what you would do. Okay. And you were saying a lot of us have like a palette, you know, underneath the sink, in the back of the closet where right. we can play a little bit with this. Exactly. Okay, so you're putting more of like a brown on there yeah, just like to make bronzy, it. Yeah, like a bronzy, just to even give it like a little softer effect. Okay. So it doesn't look so... Crazy? Yeah. Okay, but Crazy. on her skin tone and her age, it looks pretty cool. Okay, look up. Right. Oh, that does look cool. It, it blends it nicely. It does. All right, and then how much, I know that you are a blush fan. I love blush. But yeah. some of these blushes are like full on red that they're showing. So right. you say go with what your regular blush is or what? So, well, peach is universal. It looks good on any skin tone, pink or yellow. Okay. Okay. Um, as we hit 30 and go up, we start to lose the coloring in our skin. What I'm finding is it's more about the age and the undertone. Okay. So somebody that's a little bit more mature might want to um, go towards a cream blush. Okay. Because it's softer on the skin and it's not as drying. Somebody that's a little younger might um, go towards a little bit more of a powdered, powder look. And I think we haven't been wearing blush or lipstick because of our masks. No. But they are going to start coming off, we hope. Right, we hope. All right. Um, I'm loving an orange lip. What's okay. going on over here? Okay. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so this is Lauren. Hi, Lauren. And Lauren, um, obviously, this the big orange bold lip is really big this summer. Okay. And you notice her eyes are very, very minimal. Yep. But she can pull this off because her lips, it's it's the color there that's really striking. So it's kind of like, it's doable, basically, is what I'm saying. If you keep the eyes soft and the lips bold. Okay. So, like, for regular people, mm -hmm. not supermodels like these two. Right. Um, if you had to pick one trend, this is the trend you're picking? The, yeah. the, the coral pop bold lip? I love this trend, but I also love the dewy bronzy look. Okay, we'll talk about that in the right. 9 o'clock hour. Right. So you, again, used a palette to make this look. And I, show us what you do with eyeshadow. Okay. Because I do love when you give us your tips and tricks. Okay. Okay. So when we first, I first started using a little bit of gloss. Yep. And the gloss was a little sheer. Yep. So to make it a little more pigmented, I went in with a little bit. And do you, this is something we can do, it's like eyeshadow. Absolutely. Plus. Yeah. And you'll see this too, other makeup artists, they'll take a little bit of a lighter or brighter color with a little bit of glitter. And they'll kind of just lately in the middle, just to give it a bigger, fuller look, like a pouty, luminescent look with a little bit of shadow too. I love it. And you love how you look, yes? Oh, definitely. <laughs> and I think that's just it. We're now finally, everyone keeps saying we're happy, so we're gonna start playing with color again. Yes. Yeah, you like that. I do, I love it. But the big thing everybody keeps saying is too, they're looking for more mattes. Okay. Because they're concerned with the mask. Okay. But hopefully we won't be wearing the mask soon. Right. And then we can all start having a little bit more color and shimmer on our lips. I love it. I'm ready for the shimmer. I'm here for it. I love all of it. All right, so coming up in the next hour, you talked a little bit, there's a new bronze. Yes. And you think that is a more wearable look. Totally. Okay, we'll talk about it. I love it, guys. If anyone can make green eyeshadow look good, it's my lady right here. That See, is awesome. I really have always <laughs> liked that color, so I'm totally into right. it. Is that close to chartreuse? It, it seems close to chartreuse to me. Yeah, I like it. 